What if we could go on, hold the light a little longer? What if your parents could grow healthier and stay? What if all the knowledge and potential you'd gained over your life wasn't simply lost? That was the beginning of the mission video for the newly launched Jellyfish DAO, a decentralized autonomous organization focused on accelerating the development of healthspan and lifespan extending technologies. There are numerous DAOs already working in the longevity and healthcare space doing some very interesting work, including Vita DAO, Cure DAO, Longevity DAO, Athena DAO, and more. But Jellyfish is taking a very different approach. They are seeking to fund longevity focused media, including nonfiction and fiction films and videos, podcasts, games, and more. To tell you why, here are clips from their video featuring Lifespan.io's Tim Maupin and Keith Comito, who are also core members of the Jellyfish team. The problem we're tackling at Jellyfish now is how to get the public to be more on board with longevity at large and how to communicate these ideas in a positive light. Our mission is to tell stories and use the power of cinema to get people to rethink aging and many of the associated negative concerns with longevity, to which cinema and story are uniquely positioned to do. Greater public acceptance would move the science faster and ultimately more quickly reduce suffering and save more lives. One of the non-obvious things that I think actually holds back the pace of research is not seeing the value of public engagement initiatives and how that has a force multiplying effect. So even if all you cared about was just dollars going into research, I think funding media projects that get the public excited, informed, and engaged on this topic is a huge force multiplier. And that's one of the reasons why I'm choosing to spend some of my time working with Jellyfish Down. In addition to spreading the message of longevity through impactful media, members of the Jellyfish community could actually be able to influence the production of these works, taking a sort of producer role to help make decisions and even be featured in the content. Not only that, but they are discussing exciting opportunities with exclusive and original NFTs, possibly even linked to and impacted by the very same breakthrough work they go to fund. So who is this community for? Madalena Ion explains more. We're bringing together a community of longevity advocates, filmmakers, entrepreneurs, and wall breakers. I'm uh, in the film industry for almost a decade. I don't have a favorite longevity movie yet because we are about to make one. There are three initial feature films currently slated for Jellyfish support. They include a full-length adaptation of Tim Maupin's award-winning short film The Last Generation to Die, Galia Barcole's documentary Ageless, and the film Madalena just referenced there called Genethic. So how does this all work? Well, the good news is that's still being decided, and they are actively looking to grow the community. So you have an opportunity to get in early and make a real difference here. If this sounds at all interesting to you, please visit the Jellyfish DAO website at jellyfish.foundation. Once there, you can join the team, including me, on Discord. Big things are happening, and we want you to be involved. Please share this video to let others know about it as well, and help us support longevity for all. I'm Ryan O'Shea, and we'll see you next time on Lifespan News.